All right, everyone. Hey, I'm here in front of the Redding model of David Weekly Homes in Shearwater. If you like nature and you like trails, Shearwater really needs to be near the top of your list. I'm going to be doing a couple updated videos of these new models, Shearwater, Lennar Townhomes, Dreamfinders, and giving you an update now that Shearwater is nearly half sold out. So let's hang together. I'm Josh Rogers. If this is the first time that we're meeting, I'm a real estate agent here in Northeast Florida of 15 years. I really hope to be a real estate resource for you to make your life easier. And I love giving lifestyle videos of St. Johns County. I love giving real estate videos, community tours, drone tours, golf cart tours, anything and everything I can do for you to help you along your path and your goals. So for this model, we're probably gonna do two or three walkthrough tours so you can get a good idea of the layout and how everything feels. So first off, since this is the model, this would actually be a solid wall. So as you walk in, this is your entryway. And just around the corner is the actual door into the garage. So in the front of the home, right next to the entrance is, is this laundry room. I'm curious, how do you like the idea of the laundry room being here in the front? It's, uh, it's different, right? Different concept. What we're gonna find though is where it frees up space in the rest of the house. But yeah, you have, you have the laundry right here at the front. Now also, if you're wondering what this is, any guesses? It's got 120 on that. That's the thermostat for your tankless hot water heater. We'll do another video on exactly what that is. So now here is a coat closet vacuum closet and then your AC handler so check this out what's your feedback about this what's your thoughts something that you need to be aware of right when you walk in basically all the utilities are gonna be right here to the right you know I bet guests would probably think like this is where a guest bathroom would be but it's not so as we walk in wow this is actually really beautiful though check this out Nice wide space, beautiful open kitchen, open, this is like breakfast, a gigantic breakfast room. Obviously you have it set up as a dining, but you could also, if you want the formal dining, look how perfect this is with the step ceiling, have a nice dining room light there, with the dining room table. You know, I was just talking to a family yesterday and she said it's really important to her to have a legitimate formal dining room. So that makes sense. This could double as that. This, hey, how are you? How are you doing? This can be a flex space for you. Um, leave it open, or you could even put some French doors on there, close it in, could be an office. Could be another secondary, say, uh, living room for the kids. You know, I, I remember immediately what really stands out to me with david weekly homes each builder kind of has like their thing like their own little charm and signature thing and i remember with david weekly their oversized windows are just beautiful it brings in so much natural light and it changes the feel of the room look how big those windows are and then i'm such a fan of having glass inserts on the door because look at the difference can you imagine if that door was just a solid panel door how dark that area would be so adding the glass to the doors is well worth it in my opinion. A lot of recessed lights added to here. Pro tip is go bananas with recessed lights whenever you're at the uh, design stage. You'll never regret adding more recessed lights. Having a properly and well lit room makes it feel larger, more spacious. Check out these, uh, these pendant lights. These are actually, I think, gosh, it, it really fits 
the room perfectly, doesn't it? Really m massive island. And I love how it comes out far enough. Sometimes they cut them too short and I swear your knees would be knocking the bottom, but that is great. A lot of the eating and, and, and hanging out is gonna be right here. We have what looks like a double oven, but it's a perfectly placed microwave. Built into the cabinets, super classy. That also allows you to have a classy uh, vented range. Look sharp. They upgraded the recessed light in the pantry. That's a cool move. I like that. And then you have the gas stove integrated into the countertop. Really nice, really seamless look. And then check this out. This is actually cool. So, hey, I think you guys can already tell I'm not just another random guy shooting videos of model homes. Like I've done this for 15 years. I actually worked for builders for seven years. So I like to really walk you through, kind of be your navigator. Like you're the pilot, this is your game, it's your money, it's your home, but it's our job to make sure you don't make any wrong turns. So I really like to give some, some feedback, some guidance, some opinions. I love how they took this backslash and took it all the way up the wall. That's, uh, that's sharp. So natural gas for, for cooking, for heating, for the tankless hot water heater, and then also um, in the backyard, you can run natural gas for a fire pit feature, for heating a pool, or even a gas grill, a natural gas grill. All right. Now there's two distinct um, styles of homes right now in these 40 foot home sites by David Weekly. One is gonna be the front garage entrance and then one is gonna be the rear garage entrance. I'm gonna show you both of those models. So a pro tip with this, this room feels small. I'll be honest with you. Hey, and here's the thing, like, I'm not trying to convince you on anything. I'm not trying to sell you on anything. I'm just going to give you some perspective. You know, all I care about is what's best for you and your family and your goals. The reason this room feels small is because it's just got too much furniture. There's really no need for that foot cushion and, and this uh, couch blocks the view of the natural light in those windows there. Should really do away with this couch. Move that couch actually right here, and this room's gonna feel so much larger. I get it, it's a model home. This is just for decorating, but even like this could be a slim line, a slim line piece of furniture. It's pretty wide, pretty thick. But anytime you have windows like this, you don't wanna block that. And I'm really digging the fan. I like the, uh, the trim and the, uh, the step ceiling. That looks sharp. But I, I do want to point out that this area right through here is very spacious. So when you have guests over, if you have uh, family members, this is gonna be, this is gonna feel really nice and open. I think, and I, th I love that flex space there because you can have kids hanging out in there. You can also have people hanging out in here. Well, hey, here's the thing. I don't want these videos to get too long because I do a lot of these videos. So the next video I'm going to do is going to be on the secondary bedrooms and the master bedroom. And then I'm gonna do a third video on the outside area, which is screened in, pavers, outside kitchen, looks really sharp. 
So um, be sure to check out those videos along with all the other ones that I do. And hey, I know you have questions, all right? Everybody's situation is different. So I have my text information below, just text me. Ping me with any type of questions that you have. And oftentimes what you can expect is myself or one of my amazing real estate partners is gonna sync up with you and kind of talk strategy and game plan, like find out what's most important to you and your situation and your timing. And oftentimes what we can do is really give you a clarity and shed light on the process and what to expect. And then maybe even show you communities that you don't even know exist. Um, that maybe their marketing is not as good as something like Shearwater, that's a better fit for you. So when it's time for you to make your decision, you'll be confident and comfortable knowing you're not missing anything. So hit me up in text. Remember, life's better in Florida, and I'll see you in the next video.